Hello, I'm a Pokeball Dread 4 and what's the So finally issue is with this doll. Crowbar does nothing. Oh wait. Um forgot. Did I use feel like I needed to use the great I don't know. I feel like a drain was important at some point. Um So you have the first floor, which is has the bathrooms there. Um, Be kind here. <laughs> hmm. Let's see here. Well, in here. We took care of one in this area. Took care of one in this. So that's two areas in area or building two. Oh, listen to that. Keeps on beeping. Are already destroyed here. Forget. Uh, where was it? I got rid of it all here. That's two. Uh, one. That one. <coughs> okay, but that's numero three. So. To do about over here. Maybe I missed something in this. Grime. Stove's not lit. Seems broken and the door won't open. Ah, oh, perfect. Crowbar. Uh, hammer. Knife. Okay, that's not opening. What was in here again? That's a little bit muddy water. Ah! Something's in the drink. That's. I knew I had a look for a drain. Just couldn't tell where. There's a doll in the drain. That doll's needing nine. Cut the doll! Okay. Lovely. Lovely. Oh. Now that all the dolls are done, 
Our work here is finished. We can go home now, Sophie. Huh. What are you doing? It won't open? Y yeah, it doesn't look like it's locked, but... I'll try it. Move aside. Huh. See? It opens. What? B but... Just don't question it, man. Ah! Ah! What was that for? There were just more shadows. I told you to knock it off. Are you trying to get me scared? I'm not lying. There really are these shadow things. I've been seeing them over and over. C come on, shadows. Just what are you trying to say? Again. From the person who believed in fairies. Ghosts? Ah! Keep! Keep! There oh my god, oh my god, this place is mine. There's a ghost, and it just came out of the sand, and I'm just moving uh, out. Oh god, please, oh god, this is bad, this please is bad, help we're gonna us. die. Shut up. I do not envy Keith. <sighs> Sophie. Um... Will says he saw ghosts, so... Mr. Keith, it's scary. Come with us. Will? Just so you know, I'm not kidding or anything, but I've been seeing all these weird shadow figures. You have to believe me. Doesn't have to. Well, I've got some good news for you. Ghosts don't exist. There you go. Dismissed. Thanks, Keith. <laughs> Hold on now. You won't come with us? Listen to yourself, Sophie. First fairies, now ghosts. What's next? Aliens? Maybe. I'll tell your dad if you keep rambling about nonsense. Out of my sight. Ugh, make fun of me, will you? Well, fine, the two of us can handle it. Come on, Will. Thanks, Keith. You are a real help. Golly. Building map post up. Oh. 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 Oh, golly. Hey. What's wrong? You can't go any further? I'm sort of scared. I've got this weird, gross feeling. I don't want to go. Huh? Why is there a cloth on this table? This sort of looks like what you put tarot cards on. Really? A friend of mine used to bring them to school. Look, it's kind of faded in the shape of cards. Maybe uh, it's meant for a three-card reading? Shoot. Three-card reading? It's where you turn over three cards from left to right, and they tell you your past, present, and future. I'm pretty sure. Shoot, I might want to write on something. Uh, shoot. Here's a pen. Uh, and this will do. <coughs> okay. So let's see. Terrica. The chariot means victory, I think. Reversed, I believe it's... Oh, wait. Shoot. I need to write down that. What's that note? Uh, no, it wasn't that. It's not the letter. No. The C notebook. Okay. I've had a new revelation. Tyranny. Unease. Ruin. Salvation. So let's see. Tyranny. 
unease, ruin, salvation. My past tyranny is well, why I'm confined here. So, tyranny is the past. Now I feel nothing but an ease, so an ease is the present, which leads ruin and salvation is the future. So, it'll be either ruin or salvation that I need to use. Okay, so, let's see. Arrow cards. The chariot means victory, I think. Reversed, I believe it's discouragement. Okay, that one doesn't matter. The emperor? Um, emboldened. And the reverse should be tyranny. So... Uh, I'll just use upside down for, you know, I'm not going to remember emperor, so, reverse four. Er, darn it, <laughs> oh, that's my fault. The magician, that means creative. Reverse it and it means... Indecisive? Okay. The justice card is just justice, surely. And if reversed, I think it's prejudice. Okay, interesting. The moon means unease. When it's reversed, I think it would mean recovery. And that is... 15, 15, 15 18. That's actually 18, so... Moon, 18. <coughs> yeah, I'll put Emperor just to remember it. The Hermit is secret. Reversed, it's probably solitude. Okay. The Hermit is secret. Oh. Sorry. That card is judgment. It means salvation and regret. Okay, so judgment or 20. Is a judgment 20. I feel like the tower was ruin. Reverse it and it becomes tension. So you also have our or sixteen. The hang. That card is the hanged man. It has the meanings trial and limit. Trial and limit. Interesting. The death card? Um, turning point. And reversed, I think it's laziness. That's odd. <laughs> well, whatever. Oh, is that a hanged man card? You had another one? Yeah. I was given it. By who? I don't know. Eh? Hey, about this card, what's its deal exactly? Is it a bad card? Hmm, I'm not too sure either, but I think it has a bunch of interpretations. Uh huh. If you look at it this way, it looks like a man hanging from a branch and suffering, doesn't it? Yeah, looks like he's hooked on there. That sucks. Who knows if he was forcibly hanged or did it himself. Hence meanings like trial and self-sacrifice. But you see... Huh. Look at it this way, and the man is on the branch, standing precariously, maybe even dancing. Hmm. Yeah, I can't see that. I can kind of see that. Kind of. Yes, you can. That's why this card also has the meaning turnabout. After surpassing trials and self-sacrifice, a sudden reversal of fortune awaits. That's the meaning of this card. 
Oh. Learning so it's music. not an especially bad card, then. I mean, when you get down to it, all the cards can be bad or good. It's spoiler having a reverse. Pretty much. Yeah. Nice. Thanks, random guy who gave me it. Uh, and plays the tarot cards. Uh, enter is to flip the orientation. Left to right is to change position. Okay. So I'm starting with the past is tyranny. The emperor and it has to be reversed. Then with unease it is the moon just as it is and we are seeking salvation which comes in the form of judgment. Hey, yay, I got it on the first. You said you felt gross or something. Is it okay now? Yes, I'm awesome. Kind of feels a little better. Hmm, well, whatever. Hey, music, you chill out. You, you know what you're doing. You know exactly what you're doing. It's dirty. Hey! Again, why is it over here now? You saw it before too, right? This was the doll in that toilet. Is it really the same doll? It's not exactly easy to tell in the dark. Besides, who would have moved it? A jerk. Why won't you believe me? This is definitely it! That person makes multiple of these dolls, after all. Because I don't want to believe the doll moved on its own, okay? Well, yeah. Alright. Yeah, Lee, that, that's not even my regular phone. Hmm. Not getting messages. Whatever. Hmm. Do all these open? All of them open, don't they? Ah, oh, go. Gross. Not gonna deal. Hey! Hey, you watch what you're doing, game! Wooden box. Got wooden box. Scrub the paper. Gotta know. Not gonna read any of those. Shoot. Shoot. <sighs> One. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Build and circle. Two, three, four. Golly, this is a lot of information. Golly, I remember. I kind of remember getting all this information. Not really knowing what to do with it. I still don't remember what to do with it. <laughs> the magic of games like this. When you don't remember their solution. It still takes forever. And you gotta write out all your clues. Okay, so let's see. One, two, 
Third one shaded in. And okay. <sighs> What's with the wooden box? I suppose I just don't have the answer to that one. Oh, go to the bathroom. At least this game's pretty generous about going like, Hey, you need to go to this room. Hey, you need to go to this room. Or at least it usually is. Uh, I know... Uh, this one... Was broken. Uh, so I need a hammer for that one. Uh, that's set up. Get any vibes from any of the... Oh, you feel them. Oh, golly. <laughs> uh... Ceiling. Stairs are blocked by rebels. Move the table. Move the chair. Go upstairs through the ceiling. That a lot of this easier than the second time. Seriously. Whoa! That's a big cape and hole. Uh, uh, that's steel belt. Okay, that's lots from the inside. I forget all these doors are the same. There's no point in actually looking through them unless it indicates that you should look through them, like this one. I don't see the salute door to the bathroom. Maybe I just had to come back here and say. Did I get anything that would make sense? Up against that. I'll just check in a second, I guess. So that takes me to the next floor, which... Okay. Series of 12 tables. Ah! Wait. Uh... I think this is where it splits. Roll 3-5. Feel like I remember. Uh, let's give this a shot. Three, five, five, four, one. Eh, I guess that's not it. Feel like 
I was remembering. But, um. But yeah, I think I'm get about to get to the turning point. Oh. First of all, I want to get this thing set up just so the building's a little bit more connected. That's a lot better. <laughs> but, it's a lot better. Uh, just makes it a little bit easier to navigate this place. Okay, that's from the stairs. And this must be the library. Well, I'll have to get a key. That's what that's. Dining room. That just leads back to here, so. Yeah, I think this is the turning point for being so. So. I have to remember. For, yeah, data one is second playthrough. So. Because it's so far back, I'll save right over data. I'll do the bad endings first. Oh. Hello. There it is again. Get up out of here. Feeling about this area. in the trash can. Oh no. I got the first one out of the way, that was the table, so that's not it. Hmm. I'm pretty sure I figure out this one with Sophie. How many times are you gonna look, you little perv? There. That's not... I guess you have to do it in a certain order. Five, five, three, four. Hmm. Now I took Will looking at it five billion times. Black notebook. Maybe this is the notebook Edward. In that case, I shouldn't take a look inside. I'll hand it over to him if I see him. Uh, something's about to happen. Probably. Hmm. Pop, are you nearby? Are you? Okay, so I had to remember which way it is. Pop! Thank goodness I finally caught you. Don't go anywhere anymore, Pop. I'm hopeless without you. What are you doing? Sophie, uh, thanks for all your help. Now I finally caught up to Pop. Uh, huh? Pop, say hi. This is Sophie. Why are you carrying that rat? Because he's my friend. D don't tell me your friend was... Your friends are fairies. Don't go judging me. And I'm... I really shouldn't harp on that because those... I know those people are real. I don't even know if Pop and 
mime and all these people are real. Well, actually, no, I don't even know if the boogeyman stuff was real. Other than, yeah, the actual murderer. At least we can say the Crooked Man and Sandman stuff was definitely real. Hmm. This is Pop. He's my friend. I've been looking all over for him. No! Keep it away from me! That's disgusting! Pop? Wait! Y you you're friends with that rat? You've gotta be joking. Hey! Those things are so gross. Not to mention... Uh... Um... Look, I didn't mean... I just thought it was a human friend, you know? So... Uh... Your friend's pretty cute, huh? I don't really care for rats myself, but... Uh... You're not gonna sweet talk your way out of this. Go. Just go! Get out of here! Why bother showing concern for a kid who's friends with a gross rat, right? But... You need to go too. That's what I was going to do, but I'm sure as hell not going with you anymore. Sorry, Will. Wait, come on. <laughs> oh! Murdoch? Hey, let me go. Oh, Will, I have this one. Why did you throw a ball at Mitch? It wasn't me! Captain Murdoch did it! Oh, here we go again. And tell me, where exactly is he right now? He ran away because he's a jerk! He was with me earlier, but he ran when you came, teacher! Will, what do I always say? No one likes a liar. As punishment, you'll have no recess. Understood? No. <laughs> I like recess. I miss recess. I don't get recess anymore. Teacher got mad at me because of you. <laughs> it's not my fault, Will. I was doing it for you. Because I shouldn't have friends? Why do you keep messing with me? I wanted to be Mitch's friend. But Mitch treats you like a dummy. He's always smirking around you. Am I wrong? I hope friends smirk around each other. You. I hope people are happy to be your friend. <laughs> Should he be frowning? Maybe you're right, but I. Listen, Will. There ain't no reason to be friendly with people who don't understand you. Not Mitch. Not the others. Not teacher. Yes, because. That way, no one will ever understand your pain and can never be friends with you, ever. Good friends gotta have understanding. Nobody out of this bunch knows a thing about you. They won't even try to know. You're being kind of harsh on, you know, a ton of kids. <laughs> uh, maybe you might want to wait till they mature a little bit. Well, actually, heck, they'd probably be more likely to believe in you, Captain Murdoch. At this age? Everybody calls you weird, but you know that's not true. They're the weird ones. Yes, when you can see something that no one else can see, everyone else must be weird. They're dummies who don't know the things you know. You'd be better off on your own than trying to befriend the likes of them, don't you think? Oh, I wonder if Will would have a lot of fun talking to Paul. That'd, that'd be interesting. Ain't nothing to worry about, because you've got us. We're the only ones who can understand you. Ain't that right? Yes, I have, so far, I have a mime who doesn't say anything and always shows up in the shadows, and you, who's not helping me get friends, to be perfectly honest. Are you guys my friends? You know, I have Pops. Pops is pretty nice. He's really nice. Of course we are. Nothing lonely about it, eh, hey, Will? You've got lots of friends. <sighs> I don't know how I feel about that. Sophie! Go, 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 go! Sophie! Ah, yeah! <laughs> um... I'm 
sorry that I shouted at you. That's interesting. I'm really grateful you helped me look for Pop, but you hate rats, right? I can handle the rest myself, so... And I swear, I'll go back to David's, so please don't say anything to him. Will you really be okay on your own? I won't tell David you're here. I'll wait for a while, and if you haven't come to David's, then I'll come pick you up. And then we'll look for Pop together, okay? Am I doing this? Promise me you won't do anything dangerous. Pinky promise? Wait. Shoot. Am I doing things correctly? I guess I shouldn't know that I'm doing things correctly. And I know this is the turning point. I guess we'll just make another save. <laughs> Got it. I promise. Okay. Be careful. Hmm. Wait. Hmm. Okay. So, that needs to stay untouched. When he needs to stay untouched. Hmm. I guess the only really good one would be Data 19. So yeah, I'll just have Data 19 be the one. And then... I'll have to check out some of these and see what actually made sense to drop and what not to drop. Alright. Alrighty right. Alrighty righty right. Right? Oh, it's open now. Who would have thought? Ed. Hey, what are you Ed. doing here? I thought you were way over in the other building. <laughs> Surprised? I know all sorts of secret routes here because I used to explore all the time. Oh, cool. Could you show me some of those? It would really help me find my rat faster. <laughs> Is this the one, Ed? You found it? Oh, thank you. I'm awesome like that. Is that notebook yours? N no, it belongs to someone I knew. He showed me it a long time ago. I'm glad it was still around. It was locked in a box. You wouldn't, even if you found it, I don't know if you have. Oh, you have checked. I have enough confidence in you that you would check behind that poster and still find it. A long time ago? F 15 years back. I lived here for about a year. Um, I heard that after it shut down as a mental hospital, this was a homeless shelter. That's right. Hmm. My father drank a little too much, so he couldn't do good work and was really poor, and m mom was dead, so... Ah, uh, that's so. Then a priest at the church told us there was a place where p poor people could stay for free, and invited us here. Hmm. Mr. George, who gave me this notebook, lived here. He gave me a photo too, but I'll probably never get that back. This is a big place. Seems like it'd be hard to live in. S sort of. It was really cold in winter. But, well, we all came together and helped each other. So it was really great. Interesting. You don't look too happy, Will. Did something happen? I pinky promised someone. <laughs> I... I got separated from Pop again. Also... There was a girl helping me look for Pop, but I said some mean things and drove her off. Oh, wait, do I? I can't remember if I'm doing the right thing or not. If I was supposed to go to Sophie or just walk ahead of Elder, though. I don't know why I would. Yeah, I'll worry about that later. <laughs> Uh, those... You'd better apologize later, then. I will. Even if I did apologize, I'm sure she wouldn't forgive an asshole like me. Hey, you pinky promised. She doesn't pinky promise with just anyone. 
you shouldn't say bad words like that. Not to yourself or to other people. Fair it's enough. okay. I'm sure she'll forgive you. You're a good kid. Uh, I'll be going now. I'm still looking for something. Cool. Um, if it's okay with you, would you come with me? I'm feeling kind of discouraged being alone. Sorry, well, I'm in sort of a hurry. Okay. Uh, there's something I need to do. This notebook you gave me has the method. I can finally make some progress. If you find your t talking rat, I want to see. I really like rats. All right. Okay, I got it. Ed, do you know about the happy murders? You lived here 15 years ago, right? Y yeah, I was there. Lots of police came. It was a big thing, and then we c couldn't live here anymore. That's cool. That must have been scary. Five people suddenly being murdered. It, it, it was just natural. Uh, after all, we were really unhappy. I guess, fair enough. If a bunch of people are unhappy and shoved into just one building. Hmm. Uh, still. Bye now, Will. Hmm. Well, this is where we end this off, and... Data 19 is our guinea pig. I'll see you guys in the next video.